Yeah. Alright guys, it's at 60 Sean. Now, when I was watching the England-Panama game, Rio Ferdinand came out with something like, it was like, it was like a Royal Rumble in the, in the Panama box. And it made me think, what if the World Cup was just one massive big Royal Rumble? What if you just had one player from each team just fight it out over the top rope elimination and then the last man standing gets the World Cup. Well, thanks to the WW2K18 creation suite, we can make that a reality. As Cristiano Ronaldo, who is doing the case for him being the greatest of all time, the world of good in this World Cup, uh, is come out at number one in this Royal Rumble. So if Cristiano Ronaldo is gonna win the World Cup Royal Rumble, he is gonna have 29 other uh, other superstars or other footballers together. And at number two, it's a good face-off for the start of this rumble, as it's Neymar for Brazil. Now, you may have uh, heard that I said 30 and not 32, and that's because, unfortunately, as an Iranian uh, defender was practicing his little somersault throw-ins, he was attacked by Sergio Ramos, and then Ramos's rampage didn't end there, as he also attacked a Saudi Arabian representative backstage and bludgeoned it with a suitcase. What are the motives behind that attack from Sergio Ramos in the backstage area? It is unsure, or whether it was just Sergio Ramos just being an animal. We're not sure, but this is going to be a 30, 30 man Royal Rumble over the top rope. Every single country in the World Cup finals, apart from Saudi Arabia and Iran, who are unable to compete due to physical reasons, uh, will be represented in this contest. And we're starting off with Ronaldo versus Neymar, and Ronaldo is out of the blocks pretty fast here as Neymar gets absolutely bumbled in now. Front face lock, and at number three, Eden Hazard from Belgium. The Belgian representative, Eden Hazard, obviously favoring speed and quickness over the power and ferocity of Lukaku. And Lukaku's a little bit injured at the moment, so maybe that was the reason for going for Hazard as Neymar trying to go for the scoop time on Ronaldo, but Ronaldo still uh, having a nose to wriggle out of it. It takes down Neymar with a single arm DDT. Christian Eriksen representing Denmark. And at number four, this is complete and utter nonsense. Uh, Ericsson from Tottenham Hotspur. Guys, if you leave, a, leave your support for your country of choice in the comments. Uh, if your country hasn't qualified for the World Cup, maybe just choose a different one. As, uh, has, as, uh, as that one, Ronaldo again with a loop that is press to Christian Eriksson. Kicks in the midsection to Neymar with a nice little high kick. Spinning out Ronaldo's jaw there, but gets caught quite easy. Hazard's got uh, Eriksson on the ropes. And at number five, one of the main culprits of the Royal Rumble call from Rio Ferdinand, Roman Torres, in at number five. Look at Ronaldo. Ronaldo already celebrating another Pan 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 Maniac? Panamanian? Oh, he's gone anyway! Roman Torres tried to pick a fight with Ronaldo. Bit off a little bit more than he could chew then, champ. And Ronaldo just sends Roman Torres over the top rope. He's just a football fan and not a Royal Rumble fan. That is how people get eliminated. Thrown over the top rope, new competitor out every 30 seconds. Right answer, Eric. Roman Torres, mate, you've had an absolute shocker, son. It's been a bad World Cup for Roman Torres, but an absolute legend in Panama. Number six, someone else who hasn't had the finest of World Cups is Lewandowski. Robert Lewandowski from Poland coming in here. Hope, I mean, didn't do too bad. Well, his country didn't do too well in the World Cup, but maybe he can turn that around and restore, restore some glory to Poland by winning this World Cup Rumble. He's not drawn the best number at number six, but he's going straight for Neymar, as now Hazard is just doing springboard backflips for absolutely zero reason. Ericsson in trouble on the ropes. Lewandowski going up top, and number seven is Paul Pogba. A lot of, suit, lot of big names coming out in the early parts of this Rumble. As now, oh, Lewandowski's World Cup going bad to worse as Ronaldo just lays a big boot right under the chin of Lewandowski. And now goes straight for Ericsson. It looks like Ronaldo wants to clean a little bit of house here. Neymar reversing the scoop slam attempt by Paul Pogba. Another reverse elbow to Christian Eriksen. Ronaldo just spamming his, spamming his elbows here. Eriksen. Ronaldo takes him down with an elbow. Neymar more with some high kicks. Who's this? Oh, mate, it's Lionel Messi. Messi coming down to the ring. Messi versus Ronaldo. Now we are finally going to get the answer to that question. Not necessarily in football in terms, but just who's going to win in a fight between Messi and Ronaldo. 
Messi coming in at number eight. Unless Ronaldo. Oh, here he comes. He's going to go straight for Ronaldo. Oh, he takes him down. Lionel Messi taking down Ronaldo from behind. But Pogba manages to catch him before Messi can follow up on any other offense. Pogba now. Messi coming back. I mean, oh, big super kick. Right under the chin of Paul Pogba. And again, seems to be going for, uh, for Ronaldo. But Ericsson's got Neymar in trouble here. And now Messi going once again straight with the right hand to Ronaldo. Spinning back kick. Argentina may not have even qualified by the time this video is uploaded. Another spin kick from Messi. Messi and Ronaldo going out. Who just came in then? Who just came in then? Is that a Moroccan fella? <laughs> totally missed who came in then. I think that was someone from Morocco has entered in. I can't even remember who I made from Morocco now, which is pretty embarrassing. Uh, Ronaldo sending Messi out over the top rope, but Messi managing to climb straight back in. A representative of Morocco trying to take down Ronaldo, and that was nicer, a nice Pele kick. Obviously, Neymar hits the Pele kick, and the Manu Matic in at number 10. A big old Serbian. As the ring is filling up, and Paul Pogba with a right hand, and now look what's going on here. And look at Messi is just flying in at Ronaldo, and it looks like Eden Hazard has been eliminated. A lot of stuff going on in this Royal Rumble. Quite a lot to keep an eye on. Ronaldo blocking, uh, blocking the right hand of Messi, sending him over the top rope. Ronaldo's got Messi in trouble here. Ronaldo, Messi's in big trouble here. Ronaldo with two right hands, a big right hand, and Ronaldo is eliminating Messi. Huge scenes in this World Cup Rumble. Messi eliminated Messi with an underwhelming tournament and an underwhelming Royal Rumble. I mean, oh, hang on, I think, and Ronaldo and Christian Eriksen being eliminated with the, uh, with the, I cannot believe I can't remember the guy from Morocco. That is so bad. Apologise to any Moroccans watching this rumble. Probably recognise, maybe you did recognise the guy from the from this great wrestler. Oh, Neymar's in trouble. He's just had his head slammed into the turnbuckle by Pogba. And Neymar's been eliminated by Pogba. Bodies flying everywhere here. And now we've got Nemanja Matic. And uh, Pogba and Cristiano Ronaldo. Oh, mate. I thought Ronaldo was going to go then. Pogba went for a drop kick. Ronaldo dodged that. And now we've got number 11, Mohamed Salah. Salah representing Egypt. And Ronaldo. Oh, Ronaldo's been eliminated by Matic. Nemanja Matic has just eliminated Cristiano Ronaldo. And now we've got Salah, Pogba and Matic in. It's Royal Rumble. Still got loads of big names still to come. Still got, um, still got representatives from England, Colombia, Croatia, Uruguay. So right, next person out. Number 11, number 12. Oh, it's Hodor Magnusson. Hodor Magnusson, who I've got a special affinity for because he used to play for my uh, team, Bristol City, until we sold him, like literally a couple of weeks ago. CSK in Moscow. Oh, Hodor is here! The one and only person with proper Bristol City connections in this match. If you if you don't have any allegiance in this match and you're an N60 Sean fan, go for Hodor. Go for lovely Hodor. And he's got, and also he's called Hodor, which is excellent. Uh, Matic in trouble. Oh here we go, Luka Modric on his way down to the ring. Look at him! Oh Hansen Panson. Uh, Salah looks to be eliminating the beast of the Mania Matic. Oh, and he's just walked straight into a belly to belly suplex of Paul Pogba. Paul Pogba has been in since number seven, who I believe, I think it was number seven. I believe it's the longest standing competitor in this match. Oh, another belly to belly suplex. This time Matic delivering one to Mohamed Salah. Hold on, mate, you need to get stuck in. You can't just, that is class of the Iceland, man, just sitting back. You can't play parking the bus in a Royal Rumble, Magnussen. You need to actually do something. 14, Luis Suarez. Oh, and Modric is out of there. As Magnussen taking the Icelandic defensive approach into the Royal Rumble, and it's not really paid off for him. And now Suarez is going to come into the ring, and I'm guessing this is going to be all out offense, and it's probably going to be a few dirty tactics as well. Drop kick, nobody home, going straight for Matic. Looks like it's going to be eliminating Matic here. 
Matic could be in big trouble. It's Pogba. Hey, it's a Pogba. Oh, cheap shot. Through the back of the head of my boy Magnussen. Salah went for a suplex on Pogba, but maybe didn't have the strength because Pogba just need him in the head. Oh, sit down. Salah just got cleaned out by Pogba then. Oh, look at my boy Hodor. A little cheeky jab and a big right hand. Suarez now working over uh, Matic in the corner. Number 15, Kalor Navas. Who I believe is the Costa Rican goalkeeper. I mean, I don't know why I believe it. I know it. I made this guy. Kalor Navas in the ring. I'm not starting to doubt myself. I'm starting to doubt myself whether it. Oh! Pop up powerbomb from Matic to Kalor Navas. Suarez in trouble. Magnussen almost eliminating Suarez there. That would have been a big old uh, skull. Stomach crusher to Kalor Navas by Matic. He's, uh, Pogba looks to be getting a little bit of rest in the corner. Magnussen sending Suarez into court. Number 16 is Javier Rodriguez from Colombia. Rodriguez on his way down to the ring. This is going to be speed. This is going to be quickness. And look at Suarez and Magnussen. Oh! Suarez is biting him! Suarez with his biting them forehead of the boy Magnussen. And what? Oh, I thought he was going to go bite the head of Rodriguez then. But I think Kalon Navas had seen enough. Kalon Navas, obviously a man of honour, breaking up these dirty tactics from Suarez, who's now got Rodriguez on the ropes. Magnussen. Magnussen looking to make a name for himself. Iceland like. Wait a minute, what, what is Matic up to then? Number 17, Son from Korea and also Tottenham. They've got a few Tottenham players in this match. Son. Was it? Oh, so was someone just going to come straight in and clean out Salah. That would have been a huge statement. Pogba now fighting back to Magnussen. Fireman's carry from Kalon Navas to Matic. Have we got a ring? We got, we got eight superstars, eight footballers in the ring here. So we're packed out. Suarez, though, looking to uh, eliminate his fellow South American Rodriguez. Oh, and Kalon Navas is eliminated by Pogba. That is a shame, and oh, hang on, Pogba now stacking up Son and Suarez in the corner. Magnussen, go on, Magnussen, son. It's Mag Magnussen's got Salah. Salah, no, no, surely not. Magnussen eliminated Mo Salah. Yes, yes, you celebrate. What a whoa, what a tilt well face buster to Son from uh, Pogba. Paul Pogba's doing amazingly. Pogba, to be honest, out of anybody who has been in this ring, is probably the most likely to maybe make a transition to be a WWE superstar. He's got all of the all of the credentials to actually make it, I reckon, in sports entertainment. Oh, but I was saying that Son's just eliminated him. Oh, Magnussen's gone berserk! Pogba and Matic both eliminated, and now a chop block to Son from Magnussen. Short mate, is, is Magnussen going to have a hat trick? Is Magnussen going to make it a hat trick and get rid of Rodriguez? Son, Suarez, Rodriguez and Magnussen. Look, Matic, you can't believe it. Pogba now making his way back to the ring. Suarez picking up Son. Oh, we see that headbutt. That was a cheeky little drop the nut from Rodriguez. Uh, and now Son eliminated by Suarez. Oh, come on, Magnussen. Don't get eliminated here, mate. Oh, no. Suarez has gone straight... As Zerkov makes his way in for the hosts, number 18, the Russian representative, Yuri Zerkov, the veteran. And what is Zerkov going to bring to the table? Just going to pose by the looks of it. Oh, look at Suarez, man. He's filth. Breaking the eyes of Rodriguez. Jaw breaker to Suarez. Zerkov now. Magnussen sending Suarez into the corner. Surely not Magnussen. Surely Magnussen cannot eliminate Luis Suarez. Go on, son. Go on, lad. Oh, I get some right hand. Not on this occasion. Casual suplex from Rodriguez. Oh, mate. Suarez in trouble. Oh, and he's only done it. He's only done it. And there's a... Bella Luene. Oh, mate. Look up these pronunciations. And to be honest, though, here's a YouTube tip. If you mispronounce something in a video, then the number of comments you get, like, multiplies by loads because people get annoyed about it and they correct you in the comments. So I'm going to go for, I think it's Ben Lewin. Former Sunderland. Well, maybe still at Sunderland, but I think he's probably going to go in the transfer window. Unless he's up for a bit of League One action. Anyway, he's from Tunisia and he's just got given 
a rolling sent on fireman carry thing by uh, Rodriguez. Oh, and he's just eliminated him. He did no like that. Zaka now, number 20 from Arsenal. Uh, Magnussen, mate, how many eliminations are you going to go for? Oh, Zaka, what a nice little running drop kick. Knife edge shot, sending out Zerkov. Rodriguez looks to be gutted to have been eliminated now. Big right hand from Zaka. Zerkov with a fireman's carry to Rodriguez. Only 10 more. Oh, drop kick taking out everybody from Zerkov. What's he going for here? Oh, big elbow straight to the sternum. Oh, it's Harry Kane! Harry Kane is here! Harry Kane making his way down to the ring. Big news! Number 21 is Harry Kane. And Harry Kane going straight for Hodor Magnussen. Go on, Harry, son. Harry Kane. Throwing, oh, he's gone straight for my boy. Oh, but the Tunisian with a cheap shot to Harry Kane. I mean, whatever that was, that was pretty much the story of that game with cheap shots to Harry Kane. Look at that! Oh! Harry Kane is cleaning house, mate! Harry Kane! Oh, no, he's just absolutely beating on the Tunisian. It's 22, Victor Moses comes down to the ring. Victor Moses. Look at that Nigerian kit, man. That kit is looking on point. And Zakanao on Zerkov. Harry Kane, nice suplex. Straight on to Victor Moses, not giving him a second respite as he comes into this. What is he? What's Harry Kane sizing Victor Moses up for here? I thought Zerkov might have been looking to be being eliminated then by Arsenal. Zaka. Oh, Harry Kane. Oh, Tottenham Arsenal facing off now. North London rivals. Big back body drop as Victor Lindelof joins the party. Number 23. Victor Moses is thrown straight out. A short stay for Victor Moses. And now Lindelof. What's he going, boys? He's going straight for Zerkov there. Right, a big wind up play. Oh, Harry Kane has just been a floor. Come on, Harry, son. Harry Kane. Taking a breather is. Zaka works out. Oh, nice fall away slam by Zerkov to Lindelof. Oh, and Harry Kane looking to save. Oh, 24 is Tim Cahill. The veteran from Australia, big flapjack. Tim Cahill in it 24. Wasn't the greatest tournament for Australia, but can he make up for it in this Royal Rumble? Oh, and Lindelof. See you later, Lindelof. And now Cahill in trouble. Kane. Another kick to the head of, uh, of Zerkov. Zerkov in trouble here, clinging on. As Harry Kane looks to be, oh mate, is, Harry Kane, is this going to be sweet revenge from Tunisia to Harry Kane? But no, Harry Kane makes the battle at number 25 is Shinji Kagawa for Japan. And, oh, Tunisia lived to fight another day. Harry Kane went trying to swing for the Tunisian, managed to floor Shinji Kagawa. And Cahill looked to be eliminated by the combination of, look, Harry Kane is going berserk here. Come on, Harry, son. We're going to win the World Cup. I swear, hey, mate, we're going to win the World Cup. I'm so convinced. Oh, mate, Tunisia. See you later. Go on, Harry, lad. Sorry, I mean, I'm a, this is meant to be a, an impartial rumble, but I'm getting, I'm getting overexcited. 26, Sergio Ramos. Ramos is in there, the Spaniard. With a kick to the... Oh, mate, Ramos going straw, oh, mate. I can see this. Is, this has is, this is got, like, semis or final written all over it, hasn't it? Oh, mate, Ramos, as Kagawa and Cahill looking to be eliminating Zaka. I thought Ramos was just going to throw Harry Kane over the top rope, and now Cahill on Zaka. Oh, look at that little cheeky high kick. Kane going for those high kicks there. Kick to the midsection. Number 27, Sadio Mane from Senegal. As Harry Kane looks to be getting rid of Shinji Kagawa. Kick to the bottom, nice little back elbow. And what is this? Kane with the choke slam! Kane with the choke slam! Kane with the choke slam to Kagawa! Straight to the depths of hell! And Harry Ka Oh, then he just had his ear smashed in by Mane. Kane taking down Mane. Tottenham versus Liverpool. Arsenal. Where's Tim Kale at the moment? Is he still at Millwall? Was he only there for just a few months? 
Real Madrid. I have no idea where Serpo is playing at the moment. But Ramos with a sneak attack on Harry Kane. Rivers DDT. Oh, mate, Ramos is going to definitely eliminate Harry Kane. I can already see it. Number 21. Oh, Chicharito from Mexico. Javier Hernandez making his way to the ring. As that guy's, oh, what a super kick. That, oh, I thought that was Ramos gone. I thought Ramos was see you later. Hernandez now in the ring. Is he going to be channeling some Mexican luchador, lucha libre? Oh, he's going for, he's going straight for Ramos. Look at, look at, oh, oh Zaka with Harry Kane in trouble. What a statement this would be from Arsenal fans to eliminate Harry Kane. And Mane's just dancing. <laughs> Mane's just dancing. Literally, is the biggest absolute cluster in the top right-hand corner of the ring, and Mane is just dancing. Ramos on Zerkov. Mane now with Hernandez. Could be a short stay for the Mexican. Sit out powerbomb from Zaka to Tim Cahill. Mexi uh, Mexico. Mexico in trouble here as Hernandez is just dumped solemnly over the top rope. Kane though trying to find space. Harry Kane runs it with a drop kick on Sergio Ramos at number 29 is Manuel Neuer. The Germans with a great draw at number 29. Great draw for the Germans and we have got some blockbuster ties in here as Mane is eliminated by Harry Kane. Germany, Spain, England, Australia, Mexico and one lap and then obviously Peru. With the Giants of Peru in at number 30. We might be seeing the end of England and Australia here. Kale and Kane in trouble but just managing to save themselves. Jaka and Hernandez both trying to eliminate Cahill and Kane. Neuer snap suplex from Sergio Ramos. Spain and Germany battling it out. Two Giants, two tournament favourites and a couple of underdogs in the form of uh, Mexico. Mexico could still do it but I don't think they're going to do it in this Royal Rumble because Harry Kane has just eliminated Javier Hernandez. Kane Set into the corner now. Cahill has got Kane in big trouble here. Harry Kane might be being eliminated here as Ramos might be getting rid of Neuer. And in at number 30 is Andre Carrillo from Watford or Carrillo from Watford. In at number 30 for Peru. Harry Kane managing to battle off Tim Cahill. Cahill's on the ropes here and Harry Kane eliminating Cahill. We're down to Switzerland, Peru, England, Spain and Germany. Neuer. Well, a shot in the midsection and this might be it and then that's Peru out of there in and out quite quickly for Peru and Neuer now with a big clothesline to Xhaka. Switzerland who have done excellently in this Royal Rumble. Oh and just Xhaka managing to just reverse Manuel Neuer. Is this our final four here? Xhaka in trouble and Ramos with a knee to the spine and I think we are down to three here. Neuer, Harry Kane and Sergio Ramos, Spain, Germany, and Harry Kane. And Harry Kane's getting double teamed by Ramos and Neuer. This is, this is nonsense. <laughs> Always said something else, eh? And look at this. Kane being peppered with leg drops from Neuer and Ramos. Oh, this is nonsense. Belly to belly suplex to Harry Kane. Is Ramos going to do a sneak of the week? Well, this is sneak of the week. A clothesline from behind to Neuer. Shades of the sort of situation that got Karius concussed in the Champions League final. And Harry Kane in big trouble. But Harry Kane battling back. Harry Kane with right hands. Clothesline knocking down Neuer in the corner. And that was a huge high kick knocking down Sergio Ramos. Is Harry Kane going to turn it down? There's a huge kick to the back of the head of Sergio Ramos. And one for Neuer for good measure. Is Harry Kett on, oh, mate? We're going to win the World Cup. Ramos has just been eliminated like a steaming sack of hot garbage by Harry Kane. He's sizing up Neuer. Neuer back in the ring now. Harry Kane whips off the ropes but gets hit with a back elbow. England, Germany in the final of the World Cup Royal Rumble. Oh, mate, I swear down, if Harry Kane wins this, we're winning the World Cup. I said, I'm putting it down there now. If Harry Kane eliminates Manuel Neuer, oh, my days, we're winning the World Cup. I'm convinced we're winning the World Cup anyway. Oh mate, look at him. This could be it. This could be it in the final. Penalty shootout. Kane, Neuer, spinning back kick. He's kicked his head like a penalty ball. Oh, he's just slapping the German about. Back, reverse back fist. Neuer, mate, it's like a penalty. Go on, Harry, son. Harry running up. No! Oh, mate. 
Oh no! Oh, I was getting chills there. I swear that was going to be like that was going to be like the final. It was I was running up to take a penalty, and Neuer just literally. <laughs> See you later, Harry Kane. Oh mate, I, the, the final flash before my eyes. Eh? Genuinely. So Neuer wins the Neuer wins the FIFA World Cup. Royal Rumble by eliminating Harry Kane in the final two. I do not think I can actually cope if that happens in real life. <laughs> I lost it a little bit there. Guys, hope you enjoyed it. Smash that like button if you did. If you enjoyed this video, we do a lot of stupid WWE based stuff um, with the creation suite. It's an excellent creation suite. It's most of it. Oh, mate, no one's got no one. I'm, I'm bummed about this. Hope you guys all enjoy the World Cup. Uh, if you're new here, make sure you do subscribe and get notifications switched on because um, we might do we might do some more FIFA World Cup WWE crossover stuff because it's lost see you later I'm genuinely gutted genuinely gutted <laughs>